hello, welcome back to KG Simple Reviews. Today I'm gonna to be reviewing this two burner electric cooktop. Let me go ahead and open this up and show you what it comes with. This is everything out of the package besides the user manual. It does have all of these different parts here on the side. So what these parts are gonna be for is this one is a little bit of adhesive cushion so that you can cushion the side of this against your countertops. You can actually install this down into your countertop. It's the perfect size if you put it this way. Um, to fit in a countertop space, which is really nice. I also really like that this has a large burner and a smaller burner right here. And then it comes with some of the other pieces that you need to install it in your countertop. It also does have these little legs that you can use if you're just gonna be using this on top of the counter, which is what I'm gonna be doing. So I'm gonna go ahead and flip this over. And I'm just going to install each of these. It's just gonna make it so this is elevated a little bit and it has this non-slip grip on the bottom. Now that we have each of these four non-slip little elevated grips here, I'm gonna flip this back over. I wanna mention that this is really lightweight and easy to carry if you are transporting it, for example, to use it outside. Um, that would be a good option for this as well. And then I just wanna show you kind of up close this smooth glass surface of the top of this. I just, that makes me really excited because I know this is gonna be so easy to clean, which is such a big plus, especially if you're using this to cook outside or extra cooktop, you just don't want something that's hard to clean. And lastly, before we test this out, I wanna mention that this is compatible with any flat bottom kitchenware. So you just wanna make sure that the bottom of it is completely flat and then it's going to work on this, which is perfect. I do really like this industrial, really sturdy looking cord here. It's about three feet long or so. I'm gonna go ahead and plug this in and then we'll try it out. Okay, I have a stainless steel pan here, for example, and I'm gonna go ahead and put this on the smaller burner just because you wanna use a pan that's gonna fit on the right burner here. So I'm just gonna set this down right here. I have two cups of water. You can see the little measuring piece on the side. There's two cups of cold water. I'm gonna put this lid on and then we're gonna go ahead and turn it on. So in order to use the top burner, it has this little picture of a filled in dot on the top um, and then a filled in dot on the bottom. So I'm gonna push this one to turn on the bottom burner. And when you turn it on, it's flashing zero. You can heat it up to low or high. And so I'm gonna go ahead and turn it on to high just because I wanna bring this water to a boil. I do like that you can push this timer option so you can have this simmering for as long as you need. Then I also do like this lock feature, just so if anybody accidentally touches one of these buttons, it's not gonna change um, whatever setting you already have it on. I'm gonna go ahead and see how about how long this takes to bring this two cups of water to a rolling boil. So I'll come check back with you in a few minutes. Okay, I just wanna show you this just came to a rolling boil that took about 10 minutes to come to a boil, which I'm really happy with. This is going to make cooking outdoors so much easier as well as just adding a couple extra burners during the holidays. This is really, really gonna come in handy. I do wanna point out that I just turned this off and it does say H for hot and it's going to keep doing that until this completely cools down just so you know that the surface is hot. So I do like that safety feature. Overall, I'm really happy with this and I can't wait to put it to good use. I'm gonna go ahead and put a link in the description down below so you can go check this one out yourself. If you found this review useful, please give this video a thumbs up and follow us for more. Thanks for watching, bye.